There are currently several challenges, including the development of robust, analytically validated predictive biomarkers of both response and also resistance. We need to certainly better uh, identify the patients who will benefit from these very rational uh, uh, therapeutics in the clinic. We also need to better identify patients who will not benefit, uh, including tracking patients on trial with, say, longitudinal ctDNA sampling, tumor biopsies, to really look for resistance mechanisms so that we can potentially add on other drugs or maybe switch them to other therapeutics as guided by their therapeutic profile. And so in these clinical trials that we've been running, we've been incorporating different biomarkers of both uh, sensitivity and also resistance moving forward.